You don't have a big squiggly mustache. For the last time, Jeff, we're listing ways I'm different from my mom, not Wario. Oh, thank God, because that was all I had. Francine enters with an armful of heavy books. Oh, Haley, looky what I found in an old picture album. She shows Haley a glamour shots like picture of Francine and five year old Haley dressed up as identical glam cowgirls. You can barely tell us apart. Only because you were always trying to make me a frilly, princessy little clone of yourself, even though that's not who I am. Oh, excuse me for ever trying to bond with my own daughter. Bond? <laughs> you just wanted your own personal mini me. Like that Halloween, you went as mini me and you made me go as mini mini me. Haley turns to this picture in the album, Francine in a Mini-Me costume and young Haley miserable in an identical smaller version. But I didn't want to be Mini-Me. I wanted to be Minnie Mouse. Or at least Mini Minnie Mouse. But that's what Dad and Steve got to go as. Haley turns to this picture in the album, Stan in a Mini-Me, Minnie Mouse costume, and Baby Steve is an identical smaller version. Okay, take a breath, Haley. Francine exits to the kitchen, floppily waving her double-jointed wrist as she goes, leaving Haley shocked silent. Toodaloo, future me! <laughs> Jeff reaches into the brim of his hat and pulls out two joints. Guess who else is double-jointed, babe? Oh, you're not in the mood. I guess I'll smoke them both myself. <laughs> and we're up in Roger's attic. Roger's reclining, eyes closed, rubbing his temples. Babe, are you all right? No, Jeff, I am definitely not fucking all right. I have to get rid of anything I have related to my mom. What about that dress? What dress? Haley looks down as we widen to reveal she is now somehow wearing Francine's pink dress. She gasps and starts struggling to tear it off, but it's melted to her skin. Freaking out, Haley runs into the bathroom. Haley runs to the sink, splash splashing water in her face, then looks in the mirror to see Francine's reflection with demonic eyes. Haley screams. Francine mockingly screams back at her, then speaks in a deep satanic affect. Time's up, Haley. Come to mama. If you just had a nightmare, please don't tell me about it. No need for both of us to get scared. Wait a minute. That's it. The way I'm not anything like my mom. You! She would never marry someone like you. Almost nobody would. Thanks, babe. <sighs> I'm not becoming my mother. I'm glad to. No offense, but being married to Mrs. S? Barf city population, no thank you. Haley's face goes white. She swallows hard. What did you just say? The memory of Klaus's list echoes in Haley's head. Laid back, except for quick bursts of anger. Yeah! Why is this motherfucking cock-cunning junior jumble so hard? Lazy. Oh, man. And I am so tired from that quick burst of anger. Heavy substance abuse. Hold on Haley's ashen face as we hear a bong gurgle and big exhale. Smoke drifts the frame into Haley's face. Oh my god. I'm not becoming my mother. I married her. Jeff leans in for a kiss. Now, give Mama some sugar so she can have them sweet dreams. <laughs> From Haley's POV, with a flash of lightning, Jeff's face briefly becomes Francine's. Haley lets out a blood-curdling shriek. 